Jordan's back. Hi. How are you doing? Are you sit not sick anymore? Kinda. You're I'll cough everyone. You're, you're kinda of still sick here. Cough, get everyone on YouTube sick. No. Oh, I haven't even been here for two minutes and Joey's already making quick sale on uh, some random Xbox game or something, but we'll do the normal. We'll, uh, actually, we're going to set up a little bit more today first, um, and since Jordan's back, and then we'll head out to Mustang and then continue the day. Out in the Mustang, smelling dead fish and rotten fruit again. It's a good way to start the day. There's a Game Boy Color that was apparently in an archaeolog archaeological dig. Jesus Christ, has enough dirt in it. Game Boy with the back with the Super Mario. Okay. And Game Boy Color, no back. But it does work. He's put batteries in it. Alright. And then the two games. What are they? Spyro. Brother Bear. And Brother Bear. Okay. Not too much, but I'll make a little bit. And it's something different to look at. Thank you very much. Thank you. 15 for it? Yeah. So we're out walking around and this gentleman bumps into us. Introduce yourself because you didn't really... Adam. Adam. He is a viewer and uh, he just bought a top loader for 45 bucks out here, which he doesn't have on him. But he already put it away, but that's a pretty good score. If you remember from a few episodes ago, it was one that I filmed that was like 50 bucks. At least I, I did film it, right? Yeah, you filmed it. Okay. I was pretty sure I did. I couldn't remember. What is it? Werewolf, the last warrior. That's cool. And then a copy of football. Three bucks for a werewolf. It is almost October. Yeah. <laughs> oh shit. No manual. Hey, who cares though? As long as the disc doesn't look like crap. Oh, it's hey, nice. Bad. One little. Max is the Max Pain. Hey, Guilty Gear. Some decent titles there. Odd World. Stream Beach Volleyball. Yes. Okay. So that's that goddamn curse is that as soon as I get a fucking copy of a game, no matter what it is, it always shows up out at the flea market for like to me. Yeah, to Joey for like five bucks. But granted I, I technically that's what I just paid for that complete one, so <laughs> that's where we got the uh, turtles in time last week for ten bucks. Yeah. Turtles in time guys booth is like cleared out right now because Adam just went and bought uh, everything. Yeah, everything from no. them. There's nothing there left. <laughs> you guys got another Laura, Laura Croft. Yeah, I didn't screw up and uh, pronounce it wrong this week. <laughs> Gonna pick up another uh, little lady for $5. It's your second hot date in a week there, buddy. Holy shit, guys. There's a fucking Halloween booth set up at the flea market. I'm in heaven. There's some kind of cool, like, props and stuff. It's awesome. Yet again, Josh is manning the booth. He won't look at the camera. He's super shy. Oh, there he is. He did it. So Aaron traded some games, actually a decent amount of games, for a complete inbox rob system. What the hell's going on over there? <laughs> Jesus, Joey. Anyways, but uh, it's not bad. It's a little dinged up on the corners, but you know, shit, that's not something you uh, see every day out here. Checking out Bob's booth and. <laughs> Bob has a Resident Evil figurine that I want. I don't own this one in my collection. Let's see if I can get it for 10 bucks, hopefully. Some of the new stuff Bob got Wario Woods, Star Fox 64, uh, where was that? Oh, Banjo Tooie, Banjo Tooie, a Yoshi, all complete, Diddy Kong Racing. A little rough, but still cool. Both me and Joey just struck out. He didn't get the Wario Woods and they wouldn't come off their high price for uh, the Resident Evil figurine, so, oh well. <laughs> Joey's so excited to go set up today. He's like, I don't even think we're gonna set up. I'm like, you better fucking set up. But I'm gonna film the side of your head the whole day, like that. This is awesome, Jordan is actually setting up my table. I get to sit down and don't have to do anything today. Set up the Game Boy game, slave. I'm not gonna do it anymore. It's your job again. <laughs> Here's just a quick recap of what uh, Joey got today. Systems in the game, and these ones for 15. What that was like, two or three bucks, I don't remember. Uh, Conquers for five, and Sexy Lara for five bucks. <laughs> so Adam's big spending today. He bought the GameCube, the GameCube screen, memory card, the cables obviously for the screen stuff, and move out of the way. 
and he bought the Mortal Kombat fight stick with the game. How much? Three dollars. Three dollars. Damn, you got a good deal, buddy. Yeah. That's what, you know, guys, that's what you get for being a good fan of the show. So if you come down to Joey's booth at the flea market. No, don't say that. Then all went three dollars. Everything for three dollars. <laughs> How much really was it? Uh, 40. 40 bucks. 35. Yeah. And then 35 for everything, including the memory card. So. Controller and stuff's in the bag. And now he has to go to work. So thanks for stopping by, Adam, and giving us your money. Bye, guys. <laughs>
and it's somewhere in the $120 range plus uh, hopefully a game trade on top of that so Aaron doesn't know that I'm chasing him down right now <laughs> he just bought the uh, Super Nintendo and some games but he didn't have the money on him so we're going back to his booth so I missed this when we were over at the booth earlier he has a complete inbox Super Nintendo with the Mario Paint inside and the Super Mario World. Uh, it's kind of cool because there's an old Kohl's sticker up here. It was $150. Bucks. Um, I think he's going to ask like $100 for the whole thing complete. How many box complete Super Nintendo did you say you had? Seven. Seven right now? Seven. Seven. <laughs> yes, and I'm not done. I want, I want them all. <laughs> so the argument going on between the two of them about the money they just gave me for the... <laughs> The this, this stuff is pretty funny. She's pissed that he just spent money. Bad, bad boy, Aaron. <laughs> in case anyone never believed that uh, Wagon Wheel was in the ghetto, we got the Dalla store. Straight up, they scrub the R off. So this is Megan. This is a, breaks a new record. We have two females at the booth at the same time. Woo, oh, I'm up three maxes over there. Um, <laughs> Megan, say hi. She works at the same game store that I work at, and she is a huge Zelda fan, and unfortunately had some of her Zeldas disappear from a, a relative maybe doing something with them. So she is buying the two that we showed in the last episode, or two of the two we showed in the last episode, and we're gonna do 15 bucks for her on it, because she's nice. Yeah. yeah. I try. <laughs> or maybe we do. We can reenact this. No, we don't have to reenact. Oh, re reenactment. Oh, take my money. There we go. Joey's received money. <laughs> Give her change. There we go. Oh. That's how it works, people. Well, thank you very much. <laughs> my mouth, Max. Do it, Max. Ow! <laughs> <laughs> that hurt, motherfucker. Not really. Guess we're saying bye to Megan. She's gonna go wander the flea markets. Thank you for your purchase. Welcome, thank you for my Zelda games. Bye! <laughs> Get out of here! <laughs> Here's another uh, game that Joey ended up getting the box for how much? I uh, paid $3 for the box. So yeah, the three fucking bucks for the box. There's no manual though, so that's okay. And the game cart's a little bit, so... What do you mean about that? <laughs> but anyway, I, I ended up, like I just said in that last pickup video, I bought mine, the game, the box for like 44, 45 bucks or whatever. So there's another friggin' thing he got super cheap right after I bought it. And then I'm gonna pick this up um, at some point. Knights of the Round, no manual, but the game looks really good. Um, and that's gonna be like $40 or so, but he's also gonna throw in, hand me my werewolf, which you saw earlier. I'm gonna pick up the werewolf from him uh, on NES, so. As we're packing up, how much money did you make, Joey? Like 240. 240. Is that good, Jordan? Will I buy you enough makeup? <laughs> <laughs> so we're done. Not a, not a horrible day. Got rid of some of the stuff that I just picked up. Max is happy. Bye. Bye. Say bye. <laughs> bye. Peace.